Okay, so this is going to be part two of the make your stock exhaust louder, or not your stock exhaust, but this is the after my aftermarket one. But I, you could do this with a stock exhaust. So um, that's the inside of my exhaust for right there, and this is the insulation that I had left. I had already previously shortened this, but what you have to do is take out your insulation because I'm using a two inch pipe. It's probably only really an inch and a half, honestly, that I need, but I, I got a two inch pipe anyway. So basically you have to now, in order to fit that two inch pipe in here, is cut a little bit of the inside of this off. And what I'm gonna use for that is just Simply, hopefully I have some... <laughs> Just a second here. There we go. Some utility knife blades. And uh, I think right there is going to be fine. So basically just cut this right down the middle. Like so. And uh, I'm gonna put this over here in case I need to use that again. Basically, let's see if I can put this up so you can see it. So basically, you're gonna take this and uh, fold it back into here, like so. Push it back in. Yeah, and I'm gonna have to even cut more of that out. So, there's no way this two and a half inch pipe is gonna fit in there. So I need to take off just a little bit more. Go ahead and do that now. Jeez. Not very much insulation left. So that's all that's left my exhaust baffle. I mean, uh, well, I guess it's a baffle or a packing. And that's almost perfect. So, now that we've got the insulation taken care of, okay. So insulation's good. Let's take this off. That's where this is gonna sit, pretty much straight down like that. So we're gonna put this back in here. It went like that. Okay, back in and still able to fit the pipe in there. Okay, so. I'm going to be right back after I get a little bit more done. Okay, so next step is going to be to cut this to the size of this pipe. Now I have a paint marker here. And all I'm going to do is just oops, simply mark where I want to cut, which is going to be right here. Right there. So now that I know that's where I need to cut, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so we're on to the next step of cutting this pipe. And the pipe is right here. That's the mark that I need to cut. And remember, uh, I'm just using a Dremel, but always remember to wear your safety glasses when you cut, okay? Safety glasses. Always have them on. You don't need a piece of flying stray metal going into your eye. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this. And then I'll get back.